Alright, hello guys, it's another guy 100 here, and today is that long-awaited update video that I've been promising for, I don't know, a couple weeks now. Well, I haven't been promising for it in videos, but I've put it in the comments. But, um, yeah, so I've been pretty busy, haven't gotten on the computer too much. Um, pretty much everything that's going up right now, video-wise, is pre-recorded stuff that I've had for a while because I haven't had really time to make new ones, and if I have had the time, it completely slipped my mind because my mic broke. Um, I had a really decent headset for $30. Lasted really well until I got up in a rush and pulled it, and the SD card kind of, or the SD port, because it was an SD port, just kind of broke out. So I don't have a decent working mic, and I'm back to square one if you watched like my original videos um, how my voice is really really quiet unless I'm in a Skype call so that severely limits how I'm gonna be doing videos for a while unless I can get a new mic or just find some way to fix it but either way here we are so some things to look forward to or think whatever updates school starting up again I'm not going to say too much on that, except I don't know how my schedule is working out so far. So I don't know how much free time I'm going to have or whatever. So we ha we'll have to see how that works out. Hopefully I can still get up videos for you guys. Um, but I don't know how that's going to work out. We'll see though. So some other things. Um, I've been recently playing, if so I can show you. The Pokemon trading card game online. Yeah. So, um, what's it called? I'm trying to figure out a way to record that so I can make some videos on that. But for some reason, Fraps doesn't want to pick it up, so I might have to find something else that will let me record it. Which is a pain in the butt, but we'll try it. If I don't get anything right away, I'll just scratch the idea. Second off, look down in the description below. What is that? It is a petite computer QR code for the one and the only move game. Which is now very... It it should be finished. Quite honestly. It should be finished. It has difficulties all set out for you. It's got color selection with two colors. It's got some secret code, cheat codes in it. And it's completely working with a timer. And yes, it's a pink stylus deal with it. With working enemies, working movement, working barrier, you can't go past the barrier. Uh, working finish. Mostly. <laughs> um, yeah. Um, high score system. So if I go back in and play easy again my high score still 15 and if I were to change the difficulty to something else say normal in this case oh, normal and I would have just screw around for a bit it is this completely separate high score show that that saves too that's still two um, and up oh, I just quit And continue. I think that just reset my high score. But, yeah. So you get the point. All of this comes down to... 447 lines of code. Um, it's quite a pain. The only thing that I cannot get to work, and it's really bothering me, is this part right here. Right, right there this whole thing right here which is the saving high scores so right now the way I have it I couldn't figure it out any other way but the high scores save as per um, session it's a session save so once you stop running the program you lose your high scores and I have no idea I've screwed around so much looked at other programs to try and copy it and it just doesn't work so, I'm not even going to try at this point. 
I have other games to program and stuff. So what I'm going to say is your final version does not have high scores fully 100% working, but everything else works. So if someone else can implement it so that there's actually high scores that are saved multi between sessions, thank you very much. You're completely welcome to put it in and then I will give you credit for it. Just send it to me or something. Give me a link, download for it. I'll re-put it up and give you credit for it because I couldn't do it. So, uh, yeah. Now, other than that, the game is 100% working outside of that. All this coding it's all done. So, there you go. Here's your here's your game. Completed in the full for anyone with petite computer. Um I believe that to be that's it. Oh, one last thing is World at War. I don't remember if I told you, but I bought World at War for custom zombies and Tim, who was supposed to be getting it as well to play some custom zombies mess with me, is not getting it. So I found one of my other friends, and he's going to try and do them with me. So we're going to try and get those custom zombies maps out. Just having some fun playing custom zombies. Sorry, I'm playing with my light thing here. Yeah. Um, if you hear a bunch of snapping and stuff. But, so we're looking to play some custom zombies. Have some pretty cool, awesome maps. I know they're older maps, but they're, they're really fun. So we're going to play them. Have some fun playing it. So, yeah. Uh, that is now it. So, I want to thank you guys for watching. Um, I hope to see you guys in the future and hope to get out more videos for you guys. But until then, peace out.